These pictures show the damage a thief left behind, a debris-filled pickup truck, and a destroyed laundromat. He took the whole machine with the whole building uh, out completely. <laughs> there is thousands of dollars in damage to repair for this small business owner, but the crime spree didn't begin here, according to Angela Diaz. They obviously stole all the tools that he had. She says this home surveillance video shows a man stealing her husband's work truck early Sunday morning. After filing a police report, the family waited to hear from detectives. That call came nearly a week later. The vehicle was found and they tried to pull the vehicle over. She says police told them Thursday their white pickup truck had been used to commit several crimes, including using it to steal the coin machine from coin up laundry just after 6 a.m. Thursday. No, I'm not angry. I just don't want people to do bad things like this. Not only did the burglar take the coin machine, the money in the vending machine was ripped out and so were all the snacks inside. He broke my snack machine. Um, he melt uh, the lock completely. Police say several hours later they got a call that the suspect was trying to open the machine using a vehicle not far away in the area of Wilbur and Franklin Avenues. When police tried to stop him, they say the man sped away and eventually drove into the Feather River. He got out of the truck, started swimming, and eventually drowned. We were just in shock. We didn't expect that outcome. Although their family is now without a truck and hundreds of dollars worth of tools, Diaz is thinking about the suspect's family. I feel for the guy's family because it's a, it's a life that's lost over something that could have been replaced. In Yuba City, I'm Brandi Cummings, KCRA 3 News.